Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Arc the Lab 3, where we will check out this crystal barrier and probably be stopped from advancing entirely. Hey, look at that! It's some kind of door made of crystal. Huh. Where's the switch? Where's the, where's the lock? The ghost dream crystal must be behind these. It seems like the obvious statement of the week, eh? Well, what do we do, Alec? Oh. Play with the recovery fountain? Why? No, let's try pushing on the crystal, I guess. Okay then, here goes nothing. And indeed, nothing is going. We need to push harder. Oh, or not. I can scarcely believe my eyes. It opened. Let's go before they close again. Right behind you, buddy. As always. The crystal is closed. I can feel it. Hmm. Crystal room. Well, that's the most beautiful thing I've ever... <gasps> oh, great. The crystal's closed again. Hmm. Well. Really? That's... Really, Alec? Come on. It's no use. It won't budge. Are you actually surprised? That's not what I wanted to hear. Can you just lie to me, Alec? Okay, then. It's open. Now we're stuck in this place. God knows how deep underground. I, I'm having trouble breathing. Is it getting hotter in here? No, lots. <laughs> having a little trouble, kids. Oh, that's the hunter, huh? Who's there? Yeah, of course. Welcome. It's about time you finally got here. I'm Tengaron, keeper of the Ghost Dream Crystal. Oh, so you're just the official judge of the people taking this trial, or what? Hey, you're the guy from the Hunter's Guild. How'd you beat us here? I mean, we did take our sweet time exploring the entire cave and stuff. Do not question my amazing powers, for I am Tangaron! Uh, okay, dude, chill. And I just happen to be the guardian of the Ghost Dream Crystal, too. I have come to deny your quest to gather a crystal fragment. I can't let just anybody take fragments and become hunters. Go home and suckle your mummies, little babies. You have a lot of growing up to do. Insulting manner or not, you won't make us leave without a crystal fragment. I've come here to follow my dream of becoming a hunter. And you've failed. Face it, kiddo. You're the dregs of hunter candidates. I can't let you have a precious crystal fragment from this most holy of places. This crystal holds the hopes and dreams of all who survived the great disaster. It is a symbol of the hope that one day the world will be as it was before that black event. And I am sworn to protect it with my power. Don't cross me, kid. But we want to make the world a better place, too. That's why I want to be a hunter. Besides, I'm not trudging back out of this rat hole without the fragment we came for. Have it your way. Okay. The only way to prove your worth is to take me on. You're still game, kid. If that's the only way, then I'll do my best. You're gonna be sorry you took us on. Maybe. <laughs> Alright. I mean, there is obviously nothing to worry. Either we're supposed to win here, or... We're... Supposed, supposed to lose, so... Either way, it's going to be fine. I mean... Um, I guess I might take a look at him. Tango around level 8. Quite a lot of hit points, but... Well, we'll see how much damage he deals. <clears throat> Certainly did not... Um, successfully stun him there. Hmm. Actually, if any enemy is, has ever been worth trying to steal from, it's probably a boss, right? Okay, should I try? Should I keep trying to, to stun him? Or actually, not stunning, confusing. It's probably not going to work, right? Hmm. Yeah, I should probably conserve my HP, uh, my my MP for attempts to uh, not not attempts for um, curing. Actually, that's what I was. Okay, noted. He has a gun. He can attack in a row. No, not entering. Actually, okay. Sometimes I don't know. 
Uh, it feels like sometimes my inputs are not recognized very readily. Maybe I should actually be worried about his health a little bit. I'll definitely heal him next turn. Gonna risk it one more time. Oh, come on. There's gotta be something to steal from him, right? Oh, this is so close. Okay. We'll be fine. Actually, oh yeah, of course. We spoke out the text that one time. Unfortunately, I can't actually stand behind him there. Oh, come on. I mean... He is... Going down. Slowly but surely. Traveler robe! Yay! Awesome. Exactly what I wanted. Really? Nothing to steal. Oh, okay. So that was the only item he had. That's lame. Uh, hit point wise, we are still looking okay. Should definitely be able to take him out like this. Yeah, see? Oh, come on. He's at. He's really at one hit point? Seriously? Well. Yes! I mean, that was <laughs> that was ridiculously easy, considering I spent half the fight, literally half the fight, not fighting him. Guess we showed you, eh, buddy? You've shown me your strength and resolve. And you have revealed yourselves to be worthy despite your clumsy demeanor. I shall permit you to take a crystal fragment. Fantastic. Yay! Crystal fragment taken. Okay. Woohoo! We got the fragment, Alec! Let's get back to the Hunter's Guild and fast! The sooner the better. This is just the beginning, kids. It gets much harder from here out. Well, thank you for the advice and vote of confidence. Good luck. Thanks. And we don't actually have to. Go out, get out on foot. That's appreciated. Well then. Well then. Uh, items. Use? Well, not really use. Travel robe. Yeah, that's just this basic piece of equipment. Probably worth like 10 or so. 10, 15 gold. <clears throat> or... Gauze, was it? Uh, say, kiddo, did you bring back the Ghost Dream Crystal Fragment? Certainly. Did you have any doubt? Here, check it out! Yep, this is the real deal. Good work, kiddo. What now? Well, let's see. I'm gonna get a plate and... But we're not hungry. No, no, you blabbermouth fool. Not a dinner plate, a metal plate. I was pressing your friend's official hunter crest. Hmm. And here it is. Congratulations, Alec. Welcome to the Hunter's Guild. Uh, he... What? Why did he... It's like... Like what? Uh, did I just misinterpret? The the dude just went to the other guy, right? He didn't give it. He didn't actually hand it to Alec. What? Anyway, <laughs> whoa! There are pieces of the crystal we brought in the crest. Yep, and he's also not looking at us. What the hell? Yep, standard issue hunter's crest, and you received some of the materials to make it. I'll treasure. Uh, I'll treasure it always. Yeah, yeah. The new guys always say that. Just remember that goofy crap when you're facing down a 50-foot fire-breathing chimera. I'd like to do that. On some level 100 or something. That wasn't too hard at all. And now you're a hunter, Alec. What now, huh? Huh? Well, I guess do hunter jobs? <laughs> I can need some medication. Uh, I kind of agree. 
Okay guys, listen up. I want to introduce our newest hunter, Alec, and his friend Lutz. Give him a hand, okay? No problem. Hi there, I'm Jay. My specialty is to track and take out wanted monsters. Most of the monsters they post over over there are ones I collect the bounty for. Well, hopefully you'll leave some for us. I'm always up for a little friendly competition, so see if you can best me. Certainly. Oh, hey there. Hey, <laughs> good job, kid. I hope you know what you let yourself in for. Being a hunter is a world of an e a world of effort. If you show yourself to be strong, civilization's best civilization civilization's best arrives at your feet. Okay. But if you're weak and indecisive, well, let's not talk about that. I'm really a hunter now. <sighs> Guild job one, hunter registration test completed. All right. So now we do some basic jobs, hunt some monsters, and. Um, then it's about time for the actual big bad of this game to enter the stage, I suppose. Now that I've got the official crest, we can take on guild jobs. Indeed. Great, Alec. Just get a job that will take us across the ocean. Away from here. I can just see it now. Beaches, treasure, women. Yeah, come on, Alec. <laughs> Your kids are a laugh riot. A laugh riot. You think you can just get a job and float across the ocean to do it? Uh, we can't? No, no, no. You need lots of experience to get a job like that. The bad part is that ETO is pretty peaceful, so getting experience is tough. You'll be lucky to have enough experience by the time you're 30, kid. What? 30? <clears throat> yeah, and even then, a job where you can travel on a boat is rare. You just say that because it hasn't been done yet. I'll change that. If I take every job I can get and do it well, I know I can make it happen. I'm going to see that world across the ocean, one way or the or another. <laughs> Good luck, kiddo. Besides, I must cross the ocean if I'll have a chance of meeting the hunter that saved me. Come on, lads, let's get started. It's always nice to see the new hunter so full of fire. Okay. We've got a number of priority requests here to choose from. You can only take a maximum of three jobs at a time. Well, that's one more than we used to. And you can do them in any order. Good to know. Right. And we just so happen to have three jobs at hand. Also, they're numbered now, apparently. Makes it easier to see if you're missing any. Uh, protect medical plans. I guess I'll just accept all of them, of course. The town herbologist, Landall, has requested that his house be guarded while he's away on business. See Landl at his home in Etio for, detail, or for details. Okay. Those med medicinal plants are valuable enough that uh, thieving scum try to steal them. Stay on guard. Okay. Supplies for Hunter J. We have received an emergency request for supplies from the wanted monster specialist known as J, the guy that just left. He is at Kiska Marsh or the Lu or the Luke Riverbank. Okay. This job has danger written all over it. Well, I mean, I've been to those places. It wasn't all that dangerous. Just to be sure you get it, kid, let me explain the finer points of this job. I need you to deliver supplies to Jay. He's a hunter specializing in wanted monsters. If you want to take him a uh, vigor seed and an adventure vest, uh, I want you to. Okay. Your job is to buy the supplies here and take them to Jay. Oh, okay. But a vigor seed and a, and a something something vest. A vigor seed and an adventure vest. Gotcha. If you're you've already got some of the stuff, that's just a bonus. Less work for you. I mean, not that buying the stuff is much work. You can't give him items you have equipped, though. Check. But if we have to buy the supplies, who's going to pay for them? <laughs> uh, that would be you. Huh? Relax, the cost of the items is worked into the bounty. I'll give you an advance so you don't stream your, <laughs> so you don't stream your shorts, kid. Hmm. 120. Okay. Jay is probably at Kiska Marsh or Luke Riverbank. We'll find him. Alright. Nasty creatures in the house. The um, abandoned house, probably. A client named Nate has requested help in a vacant house he owns in ETO. He is give he is having trouble with monsters and would like them removed ASAP. Contact Nate at the house for details. Alright. 
The opponent in this case seems fairly dangerous. Watch his step. Easy peasy. Now the real work begins. Now the real fight begins. Okay. Let's take a look at... Oh! Wand Monsters. They, they took just enough time to load for me to uh, press the button again, thinking it didn't register. Uh, so, Gary is the slime. Etero Isle Tode Bridge. Oh, okay. Also, we now get a nice little description as well. Shapeshifting Monster is attacking travelers on Tode Bridge. Remove this threat to tourism. Well, shapeshifting between different forms of blob. Uh, Odiesa, slumber flower. This odorous monster scent results in absent-mindedness and sleep. Exterminate the Fuskia freak. Fus F Fuskia? Is that supposed to be Fuxia? Because I think that's a kind of plant. Anyway, Mormo Plain? Sure, I mean, there are only so many places on this island. Uh, Razorback. A huge squirrel like monster has attacked children on the Mormo Plain. Defeat the Fang Rodent. Calamitos. Uh, it's attacking hunters on the Luke Riverbank, expanding its territory. Contain it immediately. Terminus, although this pr uh, poison spitter has yet to leave the swamp, its venom has become more virulent. V virulent? Virulent? Eliminate future risk. And Kiska Marsh. And last but not least, Elfayam. Elfayam, the poison slime. This uncharacteristically intelligent strong slime has caused untold damage. Liquefy the monster. Huh. Also Kiska Marsh. Okay, so we got plenty to do in basically all the areas there are in this, on this island. Wonder Monsters are the worst of the worst. If they aren't taken out as soon as you find them, you never know what will happen. Right. Hey kid, how's the hunter thing going on, going for you? Well, I mean, I've been a hunter for like three minutes, so... Say, I can tell you about the guild if you want. Oh, uh, sure. The island was thrown into chaos during the Great Disaster. The guild here was opened during that chaotic time to assist those in need. It was because of the Great Disaster that the guild's purpose changed a little. It turned into a more people-oriented operation. Uh, okay. As opposed to what? Guild merits? Right. Successful job completion yields not only monetary rewards, but something else. Guild merits are awarded for job completion. They're used to improve your rank. After passing the registration, everyone starts as a sissy hunter. However, with hard work, you can achieve the ultimate rank of God Hunter. Okay, what exactly does it do for me? Hmm. Job progression goes like this. Accept the job, solve it, report back to the guild, collect merits and bounty. Hunters are honor-bound to complete every job they start, but you can try to abort it, if necessary. Oh, huh. so much for honor-bound. Unfortunately, if no other hunter will take a job, you're stuck with it. Oh, so... I guess some jobs can't be aborted then? There are also times when the client will withdraw their request if you take too long. Oh. A client withdrawal counts as an aborted job, so work fast once you, once you accept a job. Good to know, I guess. I'm rooting for you. Are you working hard? Or hardly working? <laughs> um. Oh, actually... Yeah, I was thinking about this. So I have to... Manual collect the reward for this one as well. Progress through the tri to the crystal room, fought Tangeron, who supposedly guards the Ghost Dream Crystal. Won the fight and got the fragment. Job complete. Okay. Well, there's definitely a lot more, like, a lot more text involved with all of this. I mean, between the monster descriptions and more detailed job descriptions and job... I don't know, job finished descriptions as well. It's, it's pretty cool to see that there is uh, so much more effort put into all of this. Hey, if you hear about a job across the ocean, you should give it to that kid. He's definitely different than the others. Ooh, wow. He sees my potential, I guess. Hey, if there's no skin off your nose, no problem here. If I had a little more fire left, I'd do the hard stuff. But I found that living from bounty to bounty has its rewards too. Oh, that's Lattletop. Wow. Awesome. Thanks, game. And that's the Vacant House. Yep. Should I take care of the jobs in town first? I, I suppose. Um, okay. 
items. Let's see here. The travel rope. Do I have a? Uh, oh god. What did you want? Supplies. Um. Hmm. You wanted an adventurer vest and some kind of nut, right? Ah, Vigor Seed, okay. Well, thanks for <laughs> actually uh, reminding me. I remember. Well, now I do. <laughs> we'll get those. Uh, we'll get those, then head out to deliver them. Makes sense to make it. to do it in that order. What you looking for? Well, apparently, a Vigor Seed. Oh, right. Vigor Seed is the weird name for antidote in this game. So I'll buy one of those, and Adventure of this, which is pretty bad. Why you would go out adventuring without even that basic piece of equipment, I have no idea. Oh, also, yeah, we better get to him twice as fast, sure. I'm sure he'll be fine. Let's actually sell the two iron spears. Yeah, right, we did find some um, extra equipment. Travel our robe. Can I sell that? Okay. Wow, these sell for 600. If I really needed money, I guess I could sell those, but definitely going to hang up. So hold on to them. Hold on to them for now. Right. Yeah, I suppose... I don't know. I mean, technically speaking, if I was role-playing this, you know, it would make sense to go out and help the guy out in the field first. So, see here? I'm certain the job assignment said Jay was here. Well, here or in that other place. Kiss Marsh, right? Yeah. Thanks. Well, let's check somewhere else. I don't think he's here. But then, of course, monsters appeared. Not including the wanted monster, I assume. Also, we are not healed at all. Whoops. That's okay. I mean, I'm assuming. Yeah, I'm, obviously, I'll have to see. I'll have to wait until I actually encounter the first wanted monster, but I'm assuming that they'll be introduced, so to speak, like they were in the first game or the second game. Okay, please miss. That would be nice. Nope, did not miss. Um, how strong are they? 33. No. Well, I mean, I can't really reach the other one anyway, so... Yep. I was trying to put him... No, I was trying to put Alex to sleep as well. Ah, oh, that's annoying. Okay, well... Thankfully... Ah, oh, come on. Really? Wait, what? Oh, uh, that was the message alerting me that... Alec was sleeping. Gotcha. Bye bye. Oh, wait. Wasn't that the one that acted first? Oh, maybe not. Alec's still sleeping. Oh well. Well, these guys, or these things, are a little bit annoying, but nothing to be too worried about. Yeah, nasty little surprise. Uh, right, get to Kiska Marsh. Oh, hey, boy, am I glad to see you, Jay? Were you just watching? You brought the supplies, didn't you? Yes, we took your job. I figured you'd get that one. It was pretty easy. I wasn't really in much danger, just too lazy to walk back to town. How did you manage to to, to put up the request then? Hmm. Anyway. But hey, 
you're here now, and that's all that matters. Uh, so, did you bring the items? <laughs> uh, funny how Alec asks that, uh, and answers his own question, yes. Here, I got you a Vigor Seed and an Adventurer Vest, uh, Adventurer Vest, just as requested. Great work, Alec. I'll make a specialty hunter of you yet. You? Well, phew, finished! Woo! Was somewhat difficult, I just wasn't expecting the ambush. Ha, that's the best kind of job, kid. The unexpected. Those jobs get your juices flowing. They remind you that you're, that you're alive. And could stop being alive at any moment. Some of us hunters are in this just for the thrill. It's not for the money. Well, that and... And what? Well, whatever little thing I can do to make sure a kid's safe in this village. Or that a mother gathering food in the fields will come home alive. Well, that's time and effort well spent. That's dedication. You got that right. Well, enough sentimental blabber bl blabbering. I got a monster to hunt. And time is slipping away. See you guys around. I'm sure of that. Good, that's over. We'd best report back to the guild. Right. I mean, I would... Oh, okay. As we walk slowly off the map. <clears throat> I would like to heal. Oh, or no, I would I would like to hunt the uh, wonder monsters. But I guess, since that's probably not going to be super interesting, might take a couple of tries per map if it works as it did in the previous game. Maybe those monsters don't always appear. At least one of the maps has had... Well, actually, multiple of the maps have uh, two monsters that can appear. Oh, wait, what? If you're dead set, I'll keep my eyes open. Yeah, okay, thanks. Right. Attack by monsters. Okay. Easy peasy. Uh, you don't have any new jobs? You do! Examiner's assistant, huh. Uh, four prospective hunters have come to take the hunter registration test. The guild examiner seeks a hunter to help with the process. Hunter, hunter accepting job must leave at once. Oh. Let's not do that yet. Let's finish the rest first. So, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm probably going to hunt for those wandered monsters in between episodes, maybe. Or, or maybe I'll hunt for them and just show the fights against them. I'll be trying to steal from them as well, because um, with those at least there's a possibility that they'll have some nice stuff. Some maybe nicer than just a uh, Traveler's Cloak or whatever that was. Okay. Right. Okie doke. Save. I guess I'll use three save slots. That should be fine. Cycling through those. And I guess we'll tackle the uh, what seems like the easier quest first. And work up from there. Uh, hi. Who are you? We've been sent here from the Hunter's Guild. I'm Alec, and that's Lutz. Oh, right, right. You must be Lando. Correct. Oh, and this is my son, Kobo. Hello there. Hi, Squirt. Hmm. I'm sorry, he's quite shy. I'm afraid he still hasn't recovered from the upheaval after the Great Disaster. It has been quite an adjustment for everyone. I'm certain he'll recover. I just don't know when. Hey, bad things happen. You can't let it spoil your fun your fun living. Alec and I should be uh, should be emotional messes, but look at us. And perhaps that wasn't the best example, lots. Yeah, well, I'm sure this kid's gonna be fine. Hmm. All right then, Lindel. Uh, what do we need to do you f to do for you? Well, as you no doubt know, I'm a herbologist, an expert on medicinal plants. So far, so good. I'm with you. 
My job is to study plants and recommend those with medicinal value to humans. <laughs> okay. Uh, I therefore have many types of plants in my home at any given time. Is that what's in these boxes? Yes, yes. Yes, yes, and once I analyze the contents, I send them on their way. Hmm, hmm. However, today I have an urgent bus I have urgent business to attend to, and cannot leave these crates unguarded. Why? Can't you just pick some more? <sighs> oh no, these plants are quite rare and very valuable. If I were to lose these, it would be disastrous. I also need someone to watch over my boy. He's afraid to stay home alone. And so I requested a hunter from the guild to watch these crates and my son. But Papa, I want to go with you. Kobal, I can't take you with me. You are too young. But it will be all right, Kobal. This is a trained hunter from the guild that will protect you. <laughs> I mean, trained is saying a bit much, but... And, you'll sh and I'll show you some really cool tricks. Um, if anyone comes to the door, don't answer until I return. Bandits are very aggressive in trying to obtain these plans, so be careful. Understood. Hey, don't worry, you hired the best. Alright, I guess I'll be going now. What are we gonna do with the kid? He's a great A sissy. Lots, he's just a little too protected. I'm sure you'll think of something to draw him out. Just remember back to when you were a sissy. Hey, easy now. Kobal, as long as we're here, there's no need to worry. Yeah, we're the best. Mm -hmm. Unconvinced. <clears throat> How about we play some kind of game? That's fine, Lutz, but remember our primary job. Yeah, yeah, I got it. I'll keep an eye on the crates. I mean, so long as we keep an eye on the door primarily, we should be fine. So, Kobal, what do you want to play? How about Hunters and Bandits? Huh. <gasps> what was that? Uh, shh, someone at the door. Someone's at the door. <laughs> hey, open up. Oh no, they're back again. Wah! Great, just what we need. Let's see if you can calm them down. Got it. Tobal, everything's gonna be fine. Just calm down. I know you're in there. I've come to pick up the drugs you promised. Drugs? What's this guy involved in? Alec, Lundell said not to open the door. I know, I know, but something strange is going on here. Alec, this kid is scared to death. Look at him. Hey, I said open up! Okay. Uh, who is it? Hey, who are you? Nandal asked me to watch his house while he was out. What? He must have told you I was coming for the delivery. Open up! I can't do that. You're making me angry. Look, there are too many packages here. I don't know what's in them. It would be a shame if I were to give you the wrong stuff and poison you. Uh, poison? Yes, Nandal even said there were some plants he hadn't inspected yet. If you don't have an objection to dying from accidental poisoning, I guess I could. Uh, uh, hey, uh, never mind. I'll be back later. But you tell Lendl that if this happens again, I ain't doing the drop free. And next time, I'm le I'm leaving here with my drugs, one way or another. Drugs, huh? Oh, that was close. I don't know what that was on what that was about, but I'm going to find out. Hmm. See, Kobol, you're fine, just like I said. Yeah, thanks. Woo! We have a speaker at last! There's nothing to fear when we're here, kid. Uh, what was that sound? Alec, didn't you hear that? I heard it. Huh? Hmm? Wow, it's coming from that, that box over there! I thought you said everything was gonna be alright! You'll be fine, just go to the corner over there. Okay. Lutz, you protect him. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'll see what's making the noise. <gasps> Mice? Oh no, they're in the rare plants. Of course, they're feeding on the plants in the crates. We must stop them before they render the plants unusable. Cobal, you stay here. I'll do it, just watch. Those suckers are fast. I can't even tag them. Hey, those little freaks are making fun of me now. They're not gonna get away with that. Take care of them, Alec. I'll give it my best. Minigame? <laughs> really? There are three mice we know of, Alec. Oh boy. Wicked mouse, huh? They're jumping around on the crates with the plants. If you find the box where the mouse was last, you can catch it. 
Use X in front of the box where the mouse stopped to capture it. That's not how you capture mice. It sounds easy, but I had a hard time with it. Good luck, Alec. You've got five tries to catch all three mice. Really? Alright, hop to it. I cannot even... Okay, can't move yet. Or is this just... Oh, okay, I see how this works. I think it was here, right? Okay, good. You got it! Only two left. Okay, focus. <laughs> Alright. So far, so easy. Yep. Well, and here again. Alright. I was somehow expecting this to be more difficult become faster by the end, but kind of glad it didn't. Yeah, we did it! Those mice are all locked up now. Hmm, the plants seem to be alright too. See, Kamal, well, everything turned out fine. Yeah. We didn't let anything bad happen to you. But those mice should have known there was no chance with us around. Jump. <gasps> Ow! <laughs> huh? Oh no, that man's back. Papa? Oh, I'm home, Cobal. Papa! Woo. My Co- My Cobal, you're happier than I've seen you in a while. Papa, the hunters... And he told the whole story. <laughs> I see, I see. Well now, it seems as if you two did quite well with the task at hand. And my son is talking happily to boot. Thank you so much for taking my request. And we get some... Herbs for our trouble, probably. Here, take this. As a special thanks. Huh? My son is happier than I have seen him since the great disaster. I can only deduce that you are responsible f that you are responsible for that change. Thank you so much. Herb received. Wow. Really. A herb. Yay. Hey, by the way, who was the scary guy that came while you were gone? What scary guy? This one? Hey, open up. Wah, well, that scary guy. Papa, I'm scared. I know you're in there. I'm not leaving without the drugs you promised. Hold your horses, I'm opening the door. Nanel, wait. I want the drugs now. Yeah. Lay down your arms, or pay the price. Pay the price? Alec, what are you doing? Protecting you. Haha, <laughs> Alec, this is my delivery man. He carries medicinal plants and tonics to places far outside the city. I completely forgotten that I promised a full load of delivery to for delivery today. You forgot? I know, I'm sorry. I can't believe you forgot again. Uh, so this guy isn't a dope fiend that was gonna steal our pla your plans? Dope fiend? Of course not. I told you he promised me to he promised me the stuff. I, I mean, you could have said that you're the official delivery man and you couldn't you could have tried not being quite so aggressive. That might have helped. Well, uh, with the tone of voice you used, anyone could <laughs> could get the wrong idea. Precisely. We were certainly fooled. Hmm. I know his manner of speaking is kind of rough. However, he does good work, and for that I'm grateful. Okay, enough chat. Give him the drugs for delivery. Also, the word drugs can be easily misinterpreted. That should be everything. Please be careful with the tonic bottles. Got it. See you next time. Phew, what a relief. I was sure it was some drug lord out to get us. Well, it's your it's our own fault. We should have we shouldn't have jumped to conclusions. As easy as they might have been to jump to. Cobalt, come here. You're still not afraid, are you? No, I don't think so. This was a good lesson for all of us, Cobalt. 
If you get too scared, you don't always think clearly and can jump to conclusions. It's best to try to, st to stay as calm as possible to reason out problems. True. Cobal, I'm so happy you're talking again. I want to be a hunter when I grow up. Well, you'll have to work hard at being brave, then. I'll do it. Well, we should probably be going now. Thank you so much for everything you've done. Well, this job was a success. Great, let's go report that to the guild. Come again. Bye, Cobalt. Remember, be brave. Okay. I was kind of hoping for actual bandits to attack, but oh well. I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, what? Are you sure? Why is he always talking to us? Lots, he just said. Here, if you don't believe me, take a look. I gotta tell you, kid, to get a job this big so fast doesn't happen every day. Really? So he has our overseas job already? Huh. Must be some kind of reward. I wonder what cool stuff we're gonna see across the ocean. <gasps> Alec! Come on, Alec! Take the job before another hunter horns in on it! Uh, actually, I'm going to do the other jobs first. Right. Okay, of course I will. We're also amassing merits fast. Instead of giving us just, like, one or two for the early jobs. They hand us quite a bit, all at once. Alright. I kind of had something more uh, exciting in mind. This is just a dumb old vacant house. Nevertheless, this is where the client requested assistance. Well, where is it? Or where is he? This place is a, is a wreck. I don't know, but he must be here. Perhaps if we call for him. Nate, are you home? Yes. Who Who is it? Hmm, I guess he is here. My name is Alec. I'm a hunter sent from the guild. Oh, I'm so happy to hear that. You have no idea. I'm afraid I'm having trouble hearing you. Can you come downstairs? I, uh, can't do that. Why? Caught you in your undies? Lads. No, it's because of them. Who? Those demonic fiends with the eyes. Those blood-red eyes. Where? In the holes. They use holes in my floor to gain access in the dark. Huh, interesting. What kind of creatures are they? Like I said, they're hideous. Blood-red eyes, terrible shrieks, it's awful. More mice, maybe? Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh, Alec. Do we have to say Do we have to stay? I just saw something. Calm down, nuts. Their fangs make the sickening, tearing sound. Did you hear that? Yes. And they move so fast, they're nothing more than shadows to you and me. And those shrieks, you can't get it out of your head once you hear it. Just the memory of it is giving me sweats. Hey, please, calm down. Alec, I don't know. Can we get another hunter to handle this? I will not have another hunter take my job. Forget it. What was that? That sounded like mice? Again? This town really has a mouse problem. Ah, did you hear that? The terrible shrieking! Could it be... Yeah! Nate, have you seen these creatures? Because it sounds like dumb old mice. Please, don't say that. Well, this is some kind of letdown. This guy's afraid of stupid mice. Hey, job's a job. Let's get this over with. I want out of here. Well, first we need to plan to a plan of attack. How do we stop them? If we pluck the holes, the mice won't be able to get in. Another minigame, huh? It's not going to kill them, though. Does it matter? I think Sissy Pants just wants the mice out of his house. Nate, do you mind if we just block the holes? Anything, just keep them out of my house! Sounds like a plan. Let's get it started then. You should use these empty crates to block the holes. These conveniently abundant empty plates. Uh, empty crates, yes. Right, stop them. Test job, whatever. Ugh, this thing is heavier than it looks. But even you can move it, so it should be fine. We're only gonna be able to move one of these at a time, Alec. And to make things worse, there aren't any handles, so we can only push them. Right. If that's how it has to be, we have no choice. So there's... Oh. Seven holes. Really? I only saw four. Alright, there appear to be seven holes to plug in this rat's nest. Uh, mice. 
Pardon? It's not rats, it's mice. Yes, we all know that. Well, you just said rat's nest. It's a figure of speech, Lutz. Well, I figure... <laughs> I figure it's wrong. Huh. <sighs> How about we just get this over with instead of arguing, okay? No argument here. Yeah. I do agree, though. Oh, suddenly it's seven holes. Okay, how do we do this? Hmm. Push this one first. Hmm. Oh, actually, thankfully we don't have quite as much trouble pushing these things as Lutz did. Um. Okay, if I push this one down, it's gonna be stuck forever, but I can... It's sometimes with the perspective, a little bit hard to tell. Can I just push this to the side? Yeah. Okay. Um, can I take another step down, for example, without pushing the crate? I don't think I can. Not that it would be... it wouldn't be locked forever. Or would it? Oh, uh, god. Now I can do this, right? Yeah. Here I can push this one over. Like the other one. Now. Oh yeah, of course, I just pushed this down. Easy. And not to hopefully not mess this one up. Can walk over here, yeah. So should be okay pushing this down once. And actually coming around. No no wait. No no no. It's okay. Of course. Just like this. So easy puzzle, but obviously I didn't wanna mess it up and have to start over or even fail the job entirely, that would have sucked. Yeah, that wasn't too hard, thankfully. Piece of cake. Nate, you can come down now. The mice are gone. Really? Yeah. Oh! You, you blocked up all the holes! Yeah, isn't it great? I, I don't know how to thank you properly. You've made this like a new house. Uh, yeah, a new crack house. It's still a dump. <laughs> Wait, just... I think he was just thinking that. Just doing the job you requested. Like it's a new house to me without those fiends. Uh, what? Yeah, it's like a new house to me without those fiends. You see, during the Great Disaster, I was trapped underground. The room I was stuck in with... Uh, stuck in was pitch black, and it was just me and them, the mice. So he does know it was mice, okay. When I slept, they gnawed at my nose, my fingers, my hands. It was terrible. Now your fear makes more sense. Okay, you're excused. Sissy label take back. Really, guys, thanks. You have no idea what this, what this means to me. No problem, just doing a job. That was a snap. I wonder if all the jobs will be that easy. I don't know, but I think I'm going to like this. Now that we've finished, we should report back to the guild. Indeed. Another job as Hunter's Apprentice goes smooth as silk. I think we're really going to be able to make a difference, Lutz. Well, not like this, but... Me too. Come on, Alec. Let's report to the guild. Okay, for a change I could really use some fighting, I must say. I guess in the long run, I'll have plenty of fights, so I should be happy that some of the jobs are going to be different, at least. Yep, yeah, yeah, okay. Get bounty. Nasty creatures in the house. Seven whole merits. Okay. Um, right. Except job. Chase the monster egg trunk. So this is the one... Maybe not? Wait, what? Innkeeper and Idio accidentally mixed up a guest's trunk with one containing a monster egg. Okay. 
Wait, but these are not the ones. Neither of these are going to take us across the ocean, right? So am I supposed to uh, do all the other jobs first anyway? Weird. Uh, to the to take the test, right? A tough exam. Ready to take it? Uh, I guess, yeah. Oh, by the way, the examiner's over there. Yeah, I know him. Let's go, guys. You? Uh, who were you expecting? Yeah, I mean... Yes, it is I, Tengaron the Great. What are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Good idea, let's go. So maybe we'll see a little bit more action on this one. If it's back to that trial cave. Oh, actually, right back to the crystal room. Why is it taking those prospective hunters so long to get here? <laughs> you weren't so fast, I... You weren't so fast, as I recall. Here come our guests. Don't go easy on these guys. Give them a test they'll never forget. Yes. Oh. Okay. What are you doing here? These guys want to become hunters? Hey, you're the guy from the Hunter's Guild. Why'd you beat us here? Haven't I heard that somewhere before? Yeah, I think you said it when we came down here. I am the guardian of the Ghost Dream Crystal. I will only give a crystal fragment to those worthy of becoming hunters. This is a guardian? Don't make me laugh. It's just two kids and a fruit and a cape. This will be a slaughter. Who knew the hunter test would be this easy? Okay, get out of my way and no one gets hurt. Not so fast. This crystal holds the hopes and dreams of all who survived the Great Disaster. It is a symbol of the hope that one day the world will be as it was before that black event. And I am sworn to protect it with my power. Don't cross me! That's right, but stop stealing my lines. <laughs> Restore the world? Ha! <laughs> get out of your way! What? Get out of you? Get out of our way? <laughs> I don't give a flip about that. We're just looking to make some fast money. You can understand that, right? Wrong answer, guys. These candidates are not hunter material. They are consumed with only their own interests. They must be stopped. Of course. Let's show them a thing or two. I must say, I am pleased to hear you say that. Therefore, I shall give you the honor of defeating these pretenders yourselves. What? Go on, show them the strength of a real hunter. What's the hold up? Let's go! Uh, you ready for this, Lutz? As ready as I'll ever be. Okay. These are level 7. Hmm. Huh. Okay, these apprentices are ridiculously weak at point wise, so. Should really be no problem at all. Unfortunately, of course, I can't reach them from here. Hmm. That's a bummer. Looks like I can at least take out these guys in one turn. Hey, a bronze sword. Okay. Well, at least a little bit to sell. Oh. You just attack with your stick, okay, that's fine. Oh. Now what? Water crumble, what? 11 damage. Not too bad. 20 damage. One shot. And, well, just barely enough. And we level up. Only death and agility now. Hmm. Maybe the initial couple of level ups were. Oh, we buffed his attack. That's of no concern because he is dead next turn. Unless he misses. Uh, yeah, unless we miss now. Unlikely though. Yeah, so maybe those first couple level ups 
gave increased stat ups to give us a good initial boost, or maybe that was, maybe it is just based off some random value. Damn! What happened? How did you defeat us? Well, I mean, easily, I guess. Your morally corrupted attitude was your defeat. You sabotaged yourselves with selfish intent. Also, you were just weak. If you were truly worthy, you could, you would have won. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Why that laughter? Hmm. People seem to have arrived at the idea that being a hunter is easy. Nothing about a hunter's existence is easy. Nothing. They must be talented, yes, but they must also have a love for humanity. That's a great speech, but why were we... Why were we the ones doing the fighting? Shh, this is my big speech. A hunter must have both a kind heart and a will of steel. My job is to protect the ghost dream crystal from ones unworthy of its power. Done. Done. That's all good, but why were we... Why were we doing the fighting? Because I'm the guardian and you're not. That's it? Pretty much. Hmm. What? Oh, nothing. I just thought, I don't know, that there would be a more interesting reason. In any case, the job turned out well. That it did. Okay, job number five. Success. And, well, I guess I can return to town. That is about going to do it for today. Or for this episode, anyway. Um, I guess I'll rest once more right in my diary and we'll continue next time right so um, as always I thank you very much for watching I hope you enjoyed if you did please hit the like button leave a comment and I shall see you real soon bye bye